Hello friends and welcome back to another tutorial in our Next.js learning series. In this tutorial, we will talk about the ways to get started in the Next.js project. This video will give you an overview of file and folder structure of a Next.js project. It covers top level files and folders, configuration files and routing conventions within the app and page directories. Okay, let's talk about the top level folders. In version 13, Next.js introduced a new app router built on React server components which supports shared layouts, nested routing, loading states, error handling and more. The app router takes priority over the pages router. The second router is the pages router. The pages router has a file system based router built on concept of pages. When a file is added to the pages directory, it is automatically available as a route. Next.js serves files like images under a folder called public in the root directory. Files inside public can then be referenced by your code starting from the base URL slash. Next.js alternatively supports the source directory. This basically separates application code from project configuration files which mostly live in the root of the project which is preferred by some individuals and teams. Okay, let's talk about top level files. Let's talk about the top level JSON files. In the list, first one is package.json. It basically manages the project dependencies and the scripts. The second one is the eslint rc.json, which basically maintains the configuration of eslint. Next one in the list is tsconfig.json which maintains the configuration of the TypeScript and last one is jsconfig.json which is configuration file for JavaScript. Next in the list is js file which is next.config.js which is a regular Node.js module not a JSON file. It gets used by the Next.js server and build phases and it's not included in the browser build. Next in the list is ts files where the first one is instrumentation file. It's basically for open telemetry and instrumentation. It is supported by Next.js out of the box. If you export a function named register from an instrumentation.ts or js file in the root directory of your project, Next.js will call that function whenever a new Next.js server is started. Middleware.ts allows you to run the code before a request is completed. Based on an incoming request, you can modify the response by rewriting, redirecting, modifying the request or response headers or responding directly. Middleware runs before cached content and routes are matched. Next, env.d.ts is basically a TypeScript declaration file for Next.js. Next.js comes with built-in support for environment variables, .env for the main environment variables, .env.local is basically for the local environment variables, .env.production for production environment variables and .env for .development for development environment variables. Lastly, a git ignore file to ignore the git files and folders. Next.js also supports metadata in a better way. The few of the metadata file conventions are first one, let's talk about app icons. In the app icon section, we have multiple types. One is favicon file, which is .ico extension. App icon file, which is JPEG, JPEG, PNG and SVG. App icon, again, which can be written in JS, TS, TSX. App icon file, which gets generated, which is gonna be jpg jpeg and png and lastly the generated app icon file with name apple icon in extension js ts and tsx various seo metadata files are first one sitemap.xml which has the sitemap.xml extension and the generated sitemap which will be on js and ts extension there will be a robots.txt 
with .txt extension and generated robots.js and ts files. Next.js uses some special files structure to improve the way your page vital should look like. Next.js uses underscore app to initialize pages. A custom document can update the HTML and body text used to render a page, a custom error page, a custom 404 page and a custom 500 page. All of them will be in JS, TS and TSX extensions. From the next tutorials, we will dive into the practical aspects of the Next.js application. Thank you so much for watching this video till the end. Your support is really very very important. Thank you so much. Please like, subscribe and hit the bell icon for the latest updates. Thank you so much for watching.